Okay, so that's it. We all have been duped. Drip has been done before, and it crashed and burned. So what do we do now? We just roll up our sleeves, take another L, and wish that crypto finally had some sense to it. Wish that we just invested in Apple. Or should we take a deeper look and see whether or not Drip is legit and maybe there's something different about Drip that sets it apart from all the other guys. Now call me naive, right? Maybe we are crazy to believe that Drip is actually a smart investment. Maybe a year from now I'll look back on this video and be like, I was duped. I'm an idiot. Why would I ever invest my hard-earned money into a protocol developed by a guy named Forex Shark? So before we close off this video, you're afraid of FUD. You're like, what is he going to say? Is he, he's going to ruin it for us. I'm not going to ruin it. I'm going to share with you insight from a YouTube video that I didn't create. Yeah, I'm about to plug another YouTuber. That's ROI negative for me. I would ask you to like and subscribe, but how could I ask you to like and subscribe when I haven't brought you any value yet? So let's just go to it. Guys, look at If you're in Drip, you know this is your dashboard. You see these little widgets here? I want to show you something that I found on the internet, on the webs, the World Wide Web. Check this out. Uh-oh. Take a look at these logos. Boom. I go to another project called bankroll.network. Flow, baby. Look at these little widgets. It looks awfully familiar. So, Drip is a fork from Flow. So, what happened to Flow? What, what is Flow? Well, Flow, a year ago, crashed and burned. And um, you can follow their Twitter and read through it. Um, but we're going to get right to a video I found on YouTube that brought this up. And we're going to we're going to deal with it. We're not going to hype like the other channels. Like if you follow a YouTuber that's like drips going to five hundred dollars, like they're doing that for views. All right. No one knows. No one knows what the future is. If I had a crystal ball, I'd be rich. The problem is none of us do. So what you have to do when you're in DeFi is research. You look at the horse and you look at the jockey. The jockey in this case is a guy named Forex Shark. You can look at his record. And see everything he's touched and decide whether he's worth investigating and worth investing your money. Now, the jockey in this case, it's not flow. It's a protocol called drip. And he's got a brand new one coming out called the animal farm. Are these bound to fail just like flow did? Well, I want to show you a YouTube video from a guy who is like, I don't even know this guy. But I found so much value watching this video, and I'm going to share with you quickly what I found, and, uh, and then we're going to talk about it. So watch, watch this. This is this guy. His channel is Dan Passive Income and Micro Caps. Um, check out. He compares flow and drip. Let's watch this. You can see drip. You know, it's been steady, and now it's had this big climb, which is great. And if you look at the Banker X token, which is for bankroll flow. And see it sort of did the same thing so it's pretty much almost the same gains between the two tokens now let's see what happened to bankroll you can see here it got to a peak and then immediately it just went oh crap and it just got lower and lower and lower and basically now it's worth nothing and the project is dead and on drip it's pretty much at exactly the same stage right now so is this going to happen to drip as well to answer that question we actually have to look at bankroll flow to see what happened the best place I found info on Bankroll was actually on their Twitter. So I went scrolling through their Twitter archives to see what was happening. The problem starts around January 8th with this tweet. The report API, uh, the team duo, la 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 la, is reporting errors and returning empty data sets. January 8th, UI glitches should be resolved soon. January 15th, reactor is verified and I made a mistake. But if you look at the comments, this is where people are starting to not like it. Rubbish network, trash. FUD is real, your DAP tokens ain't working, why are you rug pulling? Now's where people are really starting to see the price fall. Why has bankroll value plummeted? Is this Reactor's doing? January 16th, Reactor has been taken offline due to a loopback exploit. In other words, a hack. So in other words, the thing has been hacked, there's a whole lot of bugs, a lot of stuff isn't working. So what does bankroll do? Well, they start to give away stuff, they start to do airdrops. And this is exactly what the same as Ring Financial did 
when they had their hack and when things started going wrong with them. It's not necessarily that these projects were scams or rug pulls. It's more that mm-hmm. the developers lost the trust of their community through little things that went wrong. Yep. And once that's the fastest scared, way. They pull out their money. They pull out their money. get that trust back, they actually try to give away stuff. But that's not going to work. It didn't work in Ring. You know, we don't want stuff. We want it not to go wrong in the first place. Exactly. Way. Sure, things do go wrong and they do get fixed. But when things keep going wrong and keep going wrong and you're getting hacked and all this type of stuff, then that's probably not a project you want to be a part of. So what is the difference between bankroll flow, which just completely crashed and burned, and drip, which seems to be going so well? The difference is this guy, it's Forex Shark, and he is the developer. And you can see that he's actually done a lot. And one of the first things he did is the R34P or REAP DAO. This was a really good project and a lot of- Okay, so then he talks about, um, he goes and talks about Forex Shark and uh just you could watch the whole video i mean he, he brought tremendous value and i appreciate his honesty like anyone that doesn't hype project i hate people that are just hypers um because obviously drip has a referral part to it and you know you can join my team or i'm motivated to have a huge team because i think all of us together can do a bunch of good work um you know like i like you'll you'll notice i'm i'm working on a partnership with charity water so that um, through the rewards, we can bless a bunch of people and provide clean water to people around. Like, it's crazy. It's 2022, and we're still talking about getting clean water to people in the world. Like, that's that's what they're thinking about is how do we get clean water? And, you know, if, we're, if you're blessed to be in a developed country, it's crazy. So, yeah, we're going to do good in our team, and you can join with our buddy list. But that's the problem is you shouldn't be – you don't – you got to be careful who you trust. Um you you shouldn't trust me. I'm not a financial advisor. You should do your own work. But I did um, find this article where Forex Shark, the difference between Drip and uh, Bankroll Flow, where he addresses this. This isn't like, oh, no, I've been caught. And that brought me so much peace. So I just want to read how Flow and Drip are completely different. And now you probably aren't freaking out as much. So... Let me read this. Recently through the main Drip Telegram, founder and developer Forex Shark outlined the differences between Drip and Bank Roll Flow. Drip, it pays rewards through taxes instead of through inflation. Very smart. Drip only gives bonuses for positive actions like depositing and compounding where Flow rewarded negative actions, right? So in Drip Network, every time that you withdraw your money, um, you get charged a 10% tax. If you withdraw, if you're like a whale and you decide to withdraw a certain amount, um, in the white paper, Forex Shark outlines how much tax you'll pay. He's de incentivizing people to sell. Um, and by the way, with Drip, everything that you deposit right away into the faucet, I like to say it's sacrificed, it's gone, and it's only paid back to you through 1% daily compound interest. Um, up to 365% per dollar that's in the faucet. Now, that might sound like a lot of numbers I said there, but basically every dollar you put in the faucet, you can only get 365% on that um, dollar. So I love that. There shouldn't be this unlimited um, APY or cap. There should be a cap or else these protocols will run their course and eventually they'll run out of money. Or in Flow's case, it just keeps printing new coins. And then the coins, as you know, as as supply increases, then the worth the, the coin becomes worthless, right? Just like remember the US dollar, how we printed trillions of dollars, what happened? The dollar lost purchasing power. And now we're dealing with a high inflation price because you just can't print money and you can't print coins. So does Drip do the same thing? No, it doesn't do the same thing. So let's keep reading here. Drip only gives bonuses for positive actions. The third thing, Drip doesn't have a dev wallet getting all of the rewards that are dumped on the community. I love that. Drip pays out 365% instead of 125% or whatever flow is. Uh, Drip has a structure for team competitions. There are taxes on all Drip transactions except for buying from the platform. And this is where the devs divs come in, come from. Uh, Drip has multiple large partnerships with other dev teams and major marketing firms. Flow had millions of different bugs that are exploited to force roll people drain the system. Uh, Drip has none of these bugs or exploits. Self-referring is not profitable in Drip, so people are actually incentivized to build teams. 
Um, the, and by the way, this is a similar to an Amazon affiliate, not an MLM. Like it's just one, one layer of commission, not 15. And then the guy at the top makes all the rewards. That's not how Forex de designed this. So, um, self-serving is not profitable in drip. So people are actually incentivized to build real teams. The dev of drip has a long track record. We've talked about that. I could go on and on. They're completely different in almost every way. So this is Forex. Um, you can read this article um, at cryptozoa.com. Crypt if you just Google it, you'll find it and you can read more about it. But I wanted to bring this uh, to my community's attention just because I think we should be aware that there are projects similar to Drip, but we shouldn't conclude that they're the same thing. FUD is saying, oh, that's been done before. You'll hear people say, oh, Drip is an MLM or Drip is a Ponzi scheme. You should pause and ask them, what do they mean? And, and look at the protocol, look at the, me the mechanics that are working and ask yourself, did Flow have the same mechanics? Are they the exact same thing? Um, and I think, again, I keep going back to the whale tax, the max um, payout that you can make in your Drip all of these things, the taxation, all of these are benefiting the protocol and they're serving to make DRIP a more sustainable investment. Like I say, guys, in crypto, um, even with all that said, you should only invest what you can afford to lose because there is no guarantees. These are all, we are on such early days in DeFi, it's incredible. So like, you know, I don't know if the people that were in bank were in flow were, you know, actually bad guys or what, but they found out that their protocol just doesn't work. And then when you start talking about it's been hacked and all this, I mean, I've heard it all before. Um, it's always like the alibi. We, we got hacked. We're going to do giveaways. That's stupid. Forex has been doing this for a couple decades, and he has not ever done that. All his projects are successful. They're all riding high. Right now, the price of drip is 134 bucks, so it's gone up a little bit um, today. So yeah, if you want to join um, with some of your risk capital, get involved making 1% daily compound. This might be something you want to check out. But I wanted to at least address this issue in case you come across it. Um, and it's all part of doing your research, guys. So um, if you haven't done so already, uh, make sure you guys, you know, you can like and subscribe, check out our channel. We come here every day to basically talk about DeFi, to talk about drip, to talk about the animal farm. The animal farm launches on Thursday. Um, so you're going to want to stick around for that. So like and subscribe, lots of videos coming up. You can't get enough videos on drip, can you? You love it, right? Every day you're coming here, you're going to your faucet and you're like, oh, look at 52 bucks. What do I do? What do I do? Sorry, guys. It, look at 52 bucks. Boom. I could deposit. I could claim that or I could hydrate it. You guys know what I do. I love to hydrate. So we've got 72 people on the team. I'd love to have you guys. We're actually in our Telegram group. We are exploding. We've got 234 members, and it's only been a week since we launched. But we're on a mission to get to 1,000 people, 1,000 drippers making 1%, and then also uh, helping give back to um, help build wells around the world. More details to come in that. Guys, I want to make sure you guys get your initial capital back before we get crazy and talk about giving it all away. Because remember, just because right now you look at my drip account and you're like, he's got $15,000. Look at, no, I don't. I don't have access to this money. I can't go claim, claim. I want, I want my money out. Uh-uh. It's not the way this protocol works. You want, if you want the moonshot, go for some Floki, this Floki, Uno, doggy, Mimi, coin, whatever. <laughs> Go for that. That's not what drip is. Drip is just about increasing those daily payouts. So for me right now, I've got 152.79 basically, right? You always move the decimal place two steps. And that's basically what I make a day in US dollars worth when the price of drip is 134 bucks. That's how you got to think of it. So if the price of drip stays 134 bucks, great. That means... If I claimed, then I'd be making about 152 bucks a day. Now, you, is, am I going to become a millionaire off of that, guys? No, that's not what drip is. And that's why I like this. It's kind of refreshing, isn't it? To not be over-promised the moon. 
to I'm so sick of going through Instagram and there's still these paid. There's guys that I know that are being paid to pump some crap coin that they know is a pump and dump, but they're getting paid and they must hate their community because they're lying to their community, but they make money off their community. Guys, anyone you follow like that, just unfollow. It's not cool. And I called them out, um, but whatever. So if you like, you know, this channel, we're going to try to keep it real and honest. I don't, I'm not paid by drip. Yeah. There's a referral system, but like, I don't care if you're on my team or not. Um, this isn't how I'm going to get rich is through drip guys making a hundred and something bucks a day. Like I, that's why I'm doing this video. Hear me out is because you need financial freedom. You need passive income. That's the new world we live in. And if you're not investing um, into cer certain things like this, I think you're, you're missing out on amazing lifetime opportunities. Um, but you got to do your research. I don't listen to me. I'm just some stupid YouTuber that knows nothing of what he's talking about. So there, it took care of the legal part there. But this is what I'm doing. And I invite you to be part of my team because, guys, if this is successful and we start Get, we get all our capital back um, and we take a portion of our earnings and we start pooling that together. Think of this. A thousand people taking a portion of their rewards that are coming from the drip protocol. We pool it together and we just build a ton of wells around the world. That will make your life feel so much more significant than just making more money to go buy Gucci. Um, so if that, if you vibe with that and you're like, I, I kind of want that, I want to feel like that. I want to be part of a team where we're on one mission together, join our telegram. It's in the link of the description. Um, it's so simple to do, click it, add you. And then, uh, if you do want our buddy list and all that, it's always in the link of the description, but more videos like this to come. I hope this video was of value to you. I hope I didn't scare you too much, but, um, I just wanted to bring this to your, to your attention in case you ever heard rumors about this. Um, yeah. So again, stick around. We've got so many more videos on the docket this week. So I love you guys. And like I said, this YouTube channel is blowing up and it's so fun. So thank you so much, guys. We will keep on dripping. See you guys.